Akba Mosho to you, Nick, by the way. And Akba Mosho to everyone else. Is it a crate ship? Uh, sort of. Where the crate is death. It's the follow evil Darth Vader! As opposed to good Darth... So, hmm. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Hope you're enjoying the show. We got the is this the federation b is that what this is i don't even dual lasers and leto missiles oh we have the artillery beam 40 second cooldown so we sit around for a very long time and then shoot an artillery beam and hope we win okay i'm on board let's do it I'm naming this one after Nick. And his crew will be his weapons. We've got... What are Nick's weapons? We've got the Expo. The Cleaver. Let's try to spell that right. And three times, two times. Right here. I think I want slug piloting because mind control is less bad on our weapons than on our piloting. And I think we're set to go. Congratulations to my victory, a masterpiece of the sieve? Rebels will always remember the name of their most valuable spy. Oh, I see. I see. Yes, I was fighting for the rebels the entire time. This chipper is longer than two pike beams Kappa Pride. Hey, Palward. What happened to the Slug Sea Run? Uh, one of my Twitch chat members told me to buy boarding, and then everything went to absolute shit. <laughs> instant. It was like instant. It was incredible how quickly everything went to absolute shit when I did that. I'm gonna try firing a missile at their weapons, I think. And also these. Ah. Unfortunate. <laughs> what? No. Ah, fuck. T damn it. Ugh. Hey, I just beamed them. Nice. Uh, hit shields. And hit face. I also sold all my weapons for a Vulcan. That's true, but that was an improvement. That was... <laughs> We did better once we got the Vulcan than we had been prior. I will hail the refugee ship drifting in space. I will politely decline their trade. Because I think we need missiles. Our artillery beam is ridiculous. Why doesn't the NGB have something similar? It's like a Federation thing. Why would the NGs have a Federation thing? It doesn't make sense. Don't hail them. They have to go back. Let's intervene to defend the outpost. They have a Zappadappa and a beam. Ouch. Oh, good. Should be fine from here. So how are you guys doing? We are actually killing them with the artillery beam. That's actually happening right now. 
actually happening. So I guess we want defensive systems, like hacking and cloaking is probably what we do, something like that. They're probably going to still be alive the next time it shoots. Probably, yeah. Hmm. Do we like level yet? No. That's surprising. With 50 scrap, hitting up the wizard market seems like a decent idea. Although, what are we buying? Not much. Scrapping shields too might be better. What would we buy there that would be good? Long range scanners? Actually, it might force us to dive too, to get out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we actually can't go there. Uh, I'm okay with that. I'm going to grab shields too. I think this will sometimes be pretty nice. I mean, we'll eventually want it, but right now... Okay, I don't know what that fight means, but I suspect that if we do this, we don't die as easily or something like that. Nice, we have a buffer. See? I was thinking ahead. The bomb that's hitting us isn't actually doing any hull damage. So as long as we just keep shields up against this guy, we're fine. Oh, this is going to take the longest time ever for us to finish this fight, though. Our weapons are on fire. They'll run out of missiles. Yeah, they'll run out of missiles. It's unfortunate, but that's actually how this probably ends. <laughs> Fun ship. <laughs> really well thought out, the design on this one. Good. Good. Yes. I wonder what happens if they try to run away. I guess I just like turn the missile launcher on and hope I get really lucky. That's reassuring. Hmm. Most enemies have 6 to 15 missiles and 10 drones. I had a fight where they had a defense drone and I had a hack and that was the only way I could kill them, I'm pretty sure. I think it was something like that. And I had to just shoot them with the ion for like a very, very, very long time until I had ion killed all of their drones. Is that how it worked? Yeah, that's how it worked, I'm pretty sure. Intelligent life forms. I will attempt to communicate telepathically. Welcome aboard, Phillips. So you go on shields, I think. And we have the fastest repair time possible on our shields. Makes sense.
These guys cannot break my shields too. Um, I'm gonna shoot their oxygen only. Oh, there's an ion here. I'm gonna shoot their weapons only. Hey, my weapons are down. Hey, they're down again. This is a fun fight. Okay. We did it! <laughs> Good night, Xenomorphs. Congratulations on the win you are a part of today. My shields are still down. I will fight the ship. They have a missile launcher. How the f like, I guess I have to missile launch to like counter their missile launch or something like that. I don't know. I didn't think this all through. Okay, they missed and we hit. I I think I still have to keep shooting, though. They don't currently have anybody on piloting, so my dual laser always hits. Oh, I was really confused why my scanners weren't working. It's because this isn't a scanner. Okay, well, we'll work that out now. I'll know that next time. I was curious how much health they had left. You died five jumps before I won. Oh, that's true. Ooh, tier two combat drone. We could go like cloaking drone control. Yeah. Drone control hacking even. Probably cloaking drone control. Interesting. And then we like sort of have offense as well. I'll go for fuel and risk the da what the fuck just happened? I'm fighting somebody? My engines don't work and they have a missile launcher. Alright, cool. I that wasn't part of the thing. Definitely shot the wrong part of the ship there. Not sure if I get two system slots. Yeah, I get two system slots. You always get eight system slots. God, are you serious? It's going to hit my artillery beam. Eh, that's not so bad. They would like to give me seven missiles, ten scrap, one drone part. I actually think I'll accept that surrender. We'll go civilian sector. Because Zoltan controlled wouldn't be the best. Not feeling super confident in that one. We're looking for a store. Yeah, I figured that the missiles were worth it. Nine. Nine fuel for a drone part sounds good to me. Uh, slug ship jumps into the system, was hunting the refugee ship for sport, and now they've found you instead. This is a ship that we can just disable oxygen on once and it can never get repaired. We do have to dodge some incoming laser fire. Uh, 
That's a burst laser. My piloting is not up yet. Okay. We just want to keep the burst laser offline and let these guys mope around a bit until they die. Ooh, the fire's going... Oh, f no, 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 no. <laughs> Don't do that. The fire's going to eat up their oxygen, like the oxygen that remains as well, so that's really nice. Uh, the fire might kill their ship before they die from having no oxygen. The fire should be putting itself out, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. We're good? I think we're good. We just sit. You're going to start Long War 1 with Training Roulette Plus. Is there any type of class I want Steven Flavel to be? It's with a PH, not a V. Uh, and scout. I would like to be a scout. I was just confused why it spread when it was burning in weapons and there was no oxygen being created, why it was able to spread to the next room. Because I thought that with no oxygen being created in the ship, it wouldn't be able to do that. Yeah, you got it, Morgan. Do you work at Starbucks, per chance? Uh, two wizard markets. Is this a civilian sector? Yeah. I can only really get to one of them, though. Oh, no, we go... One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. It's fine. Scouts are incredible in Long War One. Hey, it's an ion charger. That's really good. Well, it's okay. Defense two. Free system repair. I think we're going to hold out for better drone than that. Clone bay, no. Backup battery, no. I am uninspired by everything in this store. Let's take a couple of hull repairs and keep going. I don't even want to sell stuff. Maybe if there was something to buy if I sold it, but... I mean, we could go, like, Shields 3 already? That'd be funny. I think I'll pass. Let's grab one weapons so we can turn the charge ion online with the dual lasers. Hull repair drone is amazing. Uh, I don't know. War crimes? No, not right now. I don't have a drone control <laughs> for <a> start. <laughs> um. Okay. Moving on. I will never surrender my crew to slavers. Ooh, they're coming. I feel like I should be able to bio-kill this, but it's not going to happen, right? I don't have hacking. I don't... Yeah, I don't have the stuff I need. Hey, 
essentially surreal. How you doing? No, you still abbreviate Steven with a PH to Steve. All right. Yeah, Steven with a PH abbreviates to Steve with a V. Defense 2 is also very good for Federation Cruiser. Beagle wants to be an assault. Ooh. We can tag team stuff, Beagle and I. That'll be fun. You guys have cloaking and a variety of other nasty things like a missile launcher. Okay, so the only other nasty thing is a missile launcher. I think we just do that. Like the way that I already opened the doors to that room before it hit, that's because I'm fucking magic. Actual magic. Can you, like, stop shooting me, though? Maybe. No. Stop. Thank you. No. <laughs> How did I miss? Their piloting is down. I guess I didn't take enough of the piloting offline. Okay, we're out of here. Let's grab one more jump before the market. <laughs> Good night, Sir Wagapus. I'll see you on the morrow. I don't have enough stocked drone parts to go drone control. Yeah, I definitely don't have a lot of them. Let's attack the automated ship to get the storage cache. They cannot hurt me? Cannot hurt me. Oh. I didn't think they could hurt me. <laughs> Turns out I was wrong. Wasn't there a rule of thumb for month one UFOs? You just go all... Yeah, you just go all avalanche for month one, basically. For month two, you can combine avalanche and stingray if you want to be fancy. Oh, month two is weird. If you suck at the air game, you should probably just have avalanches in month two. There isn't a simple answer, basically, is what I'm saying. Usually the optimal intercept in month two involves both avalanches and stingrays, unless you're against a fighter, in which case it only involves stingrays. 
But as a general rule of thumb, if you're willing to spend a ton of money on the air game, it's harder to get unlucky with stingrays, unless you don't know how to do the interceptor trick, in which case you go avalanches. It's complicated. It's not that it's not that simple. Yes, Nick, this is the crit motion. And this ship is awesome. How dare you imply that it is terrible? Grab cloaking now. Long range scanners are here. I could sell the combat drones. We could grab a fire beam and set things on fire. Ooh. Oh yeah. I sort of want to go cloaking fire beam here. We could also not do that though. And that might be good too. Just add a heavy laser to our burst. I could grab a heavy laser and a burst laser. I can't afford them yet though. We just need one more gun. I could grab hacking. I was gonna grab hacking. It seems a bit weird to do it now though, because I can't actually afford anything. We're not gonna go drones. Set charge time on our dual lasers, 10 seconds. Drone's fire rate is somewhat variable. Yeah. Yeah, it is. They move between a series of points around your ship randomly and shoot when they get to one. If they jump between nodes that are closer together, the drone will fire more quickly, sometimes resulting in even a combat one drone dealing damage through two levels of shields. Through one level of shields, I think. Two reactors starved for power two, I have to get the heavy. It does have a breach chance and a stun chance. These things are worth something. Just feel like a burst laser is what I'm going to want in a... Well, the heavy laser is a better weapon, right? Just in general. I think it's somewhat better. Hey, we have cloaking. I forgot I bought that. How did I have money for that? That seems insane. Combat drones are better against small ships than large ships because all the points are around the edge of the shield bubble. Cool. If you don't use that trick, you know, the entire air game is like completely different. You probably just want avalanches in that case. You're going to get fewer interceptions and you definitely want to go to the US. US or like France slash Germany are probably the places you'd be okay with going then. We have to cloak the first missile. We have a rock man to deal with. He's up there. Where are doors? Oh, I didn't cloak. <laughs> man, I stood on doors and everything.
Okay, I'm not entirely sure what happened with that rock. Maybe he got into piloting before I was on doors at all. Maybe I should have been on doors forever ago. I don't... I don't know. I definitely didn't clone the first missile, which was pretty fucking bad. But then it missed, so that was good. And we're uh, out of here, I think. You're really glad XCOM 2 didn't have an air game. A strategic layer. Yeah, definitely didn't have a strategic layer. I like strategy games, though. I don't have a clone bay. I think I stay near the beacon, probably. Let's go pirate control. Let's fight some pirates. We want to dodge missile launchers. We want to get some scrap. We don't really want a wizard market right now. A ship with conspicuous pirate markings is orbiting a nearby moon. I will attack you. Sort of a jerky customer, aren't I? Okay, we gotta turn off their piloting. That'll work. There are a lot of things to buy right now. Not entirely sure how we're powering that. I guess we're turning oxygen off. All right, sounds like fun. Could have handled the Zoltans with my ion, with my ion. Is there a reason to? Isn't it just better to fight pirates anyway? Whoops. Why do their missile launchers still work? This seems insane. Did I shoot their shields or something? I don't... What? Anyway, I think we win. Ka, one, two, three, four, three. Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Hope you are enjoying the show. The only problem with France start is Russia. Yeah, usually if I go France start, I get the North American continent bonus before the Asian continent bonus. This is very hard to intercept things over Russia. Got a bomb, some drones, looks like fun. Ooh. Am I dead? I think I'm dead. That was unlucky. 
I cloaked that small bomb. Like, the small bomb can miss, right? It just, like, went on my weapons right before my salvo and rolled a 28% chance to hit, and then I was dead because I was in an ion storm. I could have shot their drone control, probably. I'm not even sure that I could have. That was sudden. You like heavy laser because it breaches holes quite often. I was more concerned about being able to clear shields fast enough in that run. Man, I feel like cheated by that. That was a brutal way to just instantly die. I'm not playing that shit again. We get two Mantis with four crew teleportation slots. This is going to be an interesting one. The Basilisk. Assaults. Rule. We have a boarding drone and a defense drone. Mantis pheromones. I'm going to rename these crew. Because these names are just not real names. What we need is a name like... Like... Fugowitz. Uh, Fugowitz. And... Um, Lungerly. Lungerly. Yeah, that's more like it. It's a little bit more sensible. Boarding drone, defense drone. We have a weapon system, but no weapons. We get one more system on the ship, which probably is like cloaking, hacking. I think I cloaked way too late. The bomb was already inside the ship. Oh. Huh. I clicked on the audio cue. Maybe oh, it's too late though. Defense drone doesn't do anything here. To go. Wait. There's a guy on my ship. Why do we start with shields too? That seems insane. Oh, they have doors. Holy shit. <laughs> For bomb weapons, you need to click before the audio. Hmm. Blade Tycon says me in capital letters. <laughs> Hello, Blade Tycon. Just a sec. I have to repair a breach in the hull, so I'll be about like five minutes or so with double mantis. All right, maybe on the next go around, we'll get it. We need to change our med bay into a clone bay. It's just like a med bay is just not going to end well with boarding. We start with no weapons, nonsense. We have a weapon system right here and we have, how much does it cost by the way? 40, it's not that bad. Oh, we have to go to the market. <sighs> Sad. Cloaking, hacking, heavy ion, shield, hull repair. I can sell all of my drones for a hull repair drone. Gonna go with no? Gonna go with no. I don't think so. <laughs> what about selling my boarding drone and mantis pheromones for a shield drone? Requires three power. I think that could be okay, but probably there's better stuff to spend money on. Upgrading systems and stuff like that. 
You need the boarding drone to take down AI ships reliably. Oh, that's what that does. Okay. Fuck. Their Mantis was a fucking killer. Their Mantis was like James Bond or something. It was like level 17 weapons or something. That was uh, unexpected. That was very sudden. Alright, let's restart. I like this ship, but uh, it probably works better with at least two crew. Mm, yeah, whoops. I could have used boarding drone there, I guess. I shouldn't have had to... Yeah, I should have just microed my Mantis better. Fuck. What was my plan if those two missiles hit my teleporter? Just kill the guys. You get to go back to your ship at the end. I'm gonna pretend that was on purpose. Okay. You got a space robo, yeah. Level 2 piloting to give you some chance of not taking infinity hull damage from missiles. That makes a lot of sense. How much evasion do I get out of that? It's not a ton, right? But it's it's something. Let's just lock that in right now. I like it. I'm not actually sure that I do like it. Seems like you can afford to take some damage from missiles. Maybe you're taking a lot of damage from missiles, though. Probably you're taking a lot. Yeah, it's probably okay. It's 8% evasion? I don't know. I don't know. Hey. Got ourselves a pilot. This seems like it will, like, potentially just snowball way out of control. I will attack the rebels. I will slap them with the mantis. Be right back. Wait, I have a defense drone. I just deploy the defense drone against missiles. Steal the civilian supplies. Ouch. Two percent evade. Yeah, unclear that that was worth twenty-five scrap right now. I mean, at some point, I'll want that for sure. Unclear that I want it right now, though. Hello. When do you want to go out? Alright, I'll finish this run. Which will probably be... Less than two hours. Could easily be 15 minutes. We have six jumps. Get one more jump in and then check out a market. Maybe pick up long-range scanners or something. Let's fight a pirate ship. Hmm. Well, this is a mess. Good. 
I really need to clone Bay. <laughs> By snowball, I mean explode. <laughs> Repair bomb's sort of interesting. Wait, no, it's not. One ion damage and stuns all crew inside the room can target your own ship. Zoltan Shield Bypass. Uh... Alright. Cool. Let's just go ahead and assume that we want that one. Well, that didn't do anything. Go for a sector one dive. And get two more fights out of it. Which be enough to grab at least two more engines, maybe maybe three more engines, sixty scrap and sector one. That's not happening, is it? Yeah, we'll we'll pass. Hey, that missed. We have 2% evade chance. Whoops, I really did not do that super well. I meant to deploy the defense drone when they have a missile launcher. I'm going to try to remember that from now on. I will inquire about their speciality. They want to upgrade my oxygen system. Nope. Let's go. Oh my god. Well, we're not going to abandoned sector, so I guess we'll go to a nebula. <sighs> Not a big fan. Why no defense drone? Question mark. Question mark is the uh, question mark is the answer. Yeah. How do I do this? Apparently we fight double mantis in a med bay, in their med bay. Okay, we killed an NG. It's a start. I think I'm gonna duck back to my ship real quick. Take their weapons out. Where are they? What? Oh, they're repairing the breach, gotcha. Okay, we're gonna have to go over again. And we're going to have to drop shields, I think. Let's send him. He went to the fucking med bay again. Okay, I think we got it. Please don't. 
please die. Oh my god, please die. Good. Okay. He is sparky. Oxygen. What is it good for? Man, if I'm man piloting, I have 5% evade. That's almost too good to be true. Is he not manning piloting when he's repairing? I don't get it. I got a rock crew member. I'm going to just assume that we're boarding with that as well for right now. Why they didn't just make the AI play to win on the hard difficulty. Um, I don't know. These guys boarded the wrong ship. Oh boy, you have boarded the wrong ship, my friends. Rock person med by micro is uh, somewhat less impressive. I don't mind that the AI doesn't play perfectly in this game. Maybe I sort of mind. I don't know, do I mind? Maybe I do mind. So how do I kill this? Oh, I just like do that and then AFK. All right. So how are you guys doing today? Good night, brass. Sleep well. The AI in this game is dumb as bricks. It's pretty, I don't know. It's, yeah, yeah, it is. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> okay, I wanna go to dinner with Caitlin sometime soon. So I'm gonna use a speed hack to make this end much, much faster. Intriguing. Intriguing. So you have a burst laser too. And a flak one. Um that's pretty good. We only have three weapon slots. It does need to be the AI does need to be better. Because a lot of the game is just understanding how the AI is bad and then exploiting it. That's just not much fun. 
I don't know. I could have grabbed a uh, different drone. I could have also grabbed the clone bay here. I feel like flak one plus burst laser though. You know? You know what I'm saying? Isn't that pretty much how most games work? Yeah, most games are sort of bad. <laughs> Just because the other games are bad in that way too doesn't really excuse it. If he needs lasers, then we have three Mantis plus Teleporter plus Zoltan Shield by... I mean, we legitimately don't need them. That's actually... We actually don't need them. I don't have them hooked up right now. I wonder if there is some way that we could make the boarding drone attack their weapons. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. Ow. Wait, our drone control got hit. Okay, so we're going to get shot by the missiles until it runs out of missiles here. I have made my peace with this. What the hell? Wait, we can... Oh, th yeah, that's better. We'll just defense drone until it runs out of missiles, and then we'll put the boarding drone back. You can make this go faster by sending over your crew and TPing them back before they suffocate. I only have a level 1 teleporter. It doesn't work. They would die. Good idea, though. Other than the fact that my crew would die ending the run. Missile launchers run out. Level 1 is enough. They have 10 HP remaining when it comes off cooldown. Um, it's not a very good idea. <laughs> just isn't just isn't a great idea. They can mind control the guy who's on their ship right before he needs to come back, for example, and then he would just be dead. Strat is to toggle defense on whenever a missile is coming. Why? They run out of missiles anyway. I mean, I guess that would kill them faster. Isn't the only thing that I gain by killing them faster that, like, my crew can't level as much? Though? I don't know. <laughs> Wait. When... Hmm. Oh, they get to stop shooting now. When these guys are attacking systems with multiple levels of power, I should let them, like, kill the bars, because they'll get combat experience. Fucking genius. Alright, good fight, good fight. Also, you lose fewer viewers. 
Yeah. If I wanted to lose fewer viewers, though, who knows? Who knows what my stream would be like? You just like log into Twitch chat on joanribs.tv and be presented a slot machine. Cool, we got some stuff. Let's leave. I got really close to teleporting my crew onto that and having them get killed. So like, that was exciting, right? Rebel controlled. I've had enough of these nebulae. I have three fuel left. I even bought fuel at the store. Hey, let's look for some fuel, maybe. Yeah? You see what I'm saying? Intruders on board. They have a med bay. So this probably has to happen. They have flak and something else scary. Ow. Oh, there was a guy over there the entire time. I didn't know that. Hmm. I think we might be dead. Hey, I have defense drones. Okay, so that shut down one of the flak that time. We have new exciting reasons to care even more than before about um, finding a store. Let's so maybe turn the engines on so we have evasion. That could be a good idea. I think we can kill this guy before he can teleport back. Oh, not my shields. Oh, God. Okay, easy. Hmm. That was a rough one. We just like ran into a flak plus laser which lined up pretty well. That was nasty. Okay. <laughs> they had borders as well. Yeah, it was an absurdly strong enemy ship. Was that sector two or three? It was sector three. That was absurdly strong. I'm gonna take Caitlin out to dinner. I'm going to eat Indian food. Is that okay? Can we eat Indian food? Caitlin says that's okay. And I am going to be back tomorrow with perhaps more of the Long War 2 campaign and some XCOM. Caitlin's away this weekend, so I'm going to just hang out. Why not just hijack their ship? All of the crew was dead. Mm. I didn't say I had a feeling it would snowball quickly. I said this can snowball quickly, Internet Kraken. Big difference. Big difference. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Thank you for all the support, all the subs today, all the bits. All the wizard pennies. And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Check out the Discord. Check out the other things. Check out the YouTube. All of the VODs are going up there now, as well as occasionally highlights of streams. I have a podcast episode up there from a while ago. I have Dungeons and Dragons going up on Jamble's YouTube and Filthy Robots YouTube. I have... I'm like, I'm all over the place. Check out Discord. That's where you can find out where I am. Usually it's Discord. It's about to be Indian restaurant. I keep things tricky, I guess. Old Bomo Show.